good morning dear children so today we will see some uh, one new thing that is rounding to the nearest 100 means to the nearest numbers fine <coughs> <coughs> so we will start from here So, rounding numbers, okay, <clears throat> a newspaper headline says 1500 people affected by floods, do you think exactly 1500 people were affected? The actual number affected may happen 1482 or 1537, what the headline means? is that the number is close to 1500 we say that the actual number has been rounded off to 1500 okay means from 1482 if it is 1482 then also it is 1500 if it is 1537 in between then it is 1500 okay so this is how actually it is to be done so rounding off to the nearest 10 so to round a number says 57 to the nearest 10 so let's see so now find the tens between which the number lies 57 lies between 50 and 60 right so find which 10 the number is closer to 57 or 57 is closer to 60 than 50 so it is rounded up to 60 fine so 50 to 60 so after 55 you count actually we divide this thing in two ways one is below 50 another is uh, from 50 to the number you, you are starting <coughs> okay uh, it is for two, two digits number actually so after that from 55 to 60 also you can say so if it is suppose uh, not 55 in 50 actually fine so uh, not uh, 50 it should be in 55 so in 55 if you come if anything comes under fine so that will be added to the uh, towards right side <coughs> okay till you get your desired result okay if the number is midway between the two tens it is rounded up to up it is rounded up for example 85 is rounded up to 90 85 rounded up to 90 yes as I, as i was saying if it is 5 means if if it comes 5 in 10 digits number then it will be rounded to the next by adding 5 okay so this is how actually they have done so uh, now round of 4, uh, 432 and 2655 to the nearest 10 okay so what will you do 40, 432 lies between 430 okay so 430 and 440 so it is closer to 430 therefore it is, it is rounded down to 430 okay so this is how actually you need to do 2655 lies midway between 2650 and 2660 therefore it is rounded up to 2660 fine so rounding to the nearest 100 to round off a number say 743 to the nearest 100 so find the 100 between which the number lies 743 lies between 700 and 800 okay so find which 100 the number is closer to 743 is closer to 700 than 800 so it is rounded down to 700 so this is your uh, 700 cause it is 743 and it is below 750 actually like that way you can calculate okay if it is 7 if it would have 750 then it would have 800 okay like that so it is below that okay next if the number is midway between the two hundreds it is rounded up 
for example 450 is rounded up to 500 yes it is correct only because f i have said midway from 5 onwards 5 upwards it should be rounded to the next desired number actually as per your question okay now rounded up to rounded off 472 and 2750 to the nearest 100 that means it will be what 472 lies between 400 and 500 it is closer to 500 therefore it is rounded up to 500 understood next is 2750 lies midway between 2700 and 2800 therefore it is rounded up to 2800 okay so this is how we do and next we will see the large actually we are taking the larger um, larger number from smaller okay next rounding to the nearest thousand okay to round off on number say 46502 the nearest thousand then find the thousands between which the number lies okay that means 4000 it will be 4000 to the nearest thousand that means 5000 so 4650 lies between 4000 and 5000 find which thousand and number is closer to 4650 is closer to 5000 then 4000 fine because look here 4650 means it is greater than uh, this thing 5 okay so here actually if it did, if it would have 4550 then also it would have 5000 okay so that is how you will have to do if the number is midway between the two thousands it is rounded up for example 9500 is rounded up to 10000 yes exactly it is correct okay so round off 6470 and 22500 to the nearest thousand so here four uh, 6470 and these two so it will be uh, yeah so it is closer to 6000 6470 in between 6000 and 7000 so it is lesser than 5 you consider 5 here so that means below 5 it is so it will come to the uh, this thing 6000 okay so it is closer to 6000 therefore it is rounded down to 6000 22 5000 means uh, 22500 lies midway between 22000 and 23000 yes therefore it is rounded up to 23000 fine so round off to the nearest 10 all this so you do it mentally you can do okay round off to the nearest 100 so all these are your like homework you can say now you take as homework okay you want to task you want to take sweets for your class on your birthday there are 46 children in your class how many sweets will you take rounded to the nearest 10 okay so you can do it on your own mentally itself okay there are 46 children okay in your class how many sweets will you take rounded to the nearest 10 so it will be if it is 46 that means it will go to what 50 means it is 5 if you put here in 6th place if you put here 5 45 so it is means greater than 5 means greater than 45 so that's why <coughs> what is the next uh, this thing number it will be 50 so you will round it it to 50 next Latha's class has 42 children she rounds off to the nearest 10 and takes 40 sweets to class on her birthday did she do the right thing why what should she have done <coughs> so this is also one question tomorrow I'll give the answer of this okay you also think this <coughs> <coughs> a newspaper reporter was told that 23,347 uh, 23, people watched a cricket match 
between India and Sri Lanka. In the newspaper, he has given the headline as 23,000. Watch cricket match. How did he round off the number? What? Okay, so you'll have to take in between 2,000 to 3,000. Then you compare this thing and put 5 here. I'm giving as a tip. Okay, put 5 here and then you count. 5 here means you compare with 5. Okay, compare with 5 here. You put fine. You put 5 here and 3 is lesser than the 5. So, it will definitely come to this side. That means in 20,000 that I have given already you the tip. So, this is the thing and after that we will do the exercise in the next class and I will see you along with your homework. Thank you. Have a great day.